All right, what's going on, everyone? Dreaded Champ here for another night of gaming. Uh, actually, I'm not going to be gaming tonight. Um, got some beads I got to put in. Uh, I have one, two, three, four, five, six strands I need to put on today. Um, got some good news to share, but that is that information is going to have to wait just a little bit longer. Um, first things first, as always, I stream for Extra Life. Extra Life is a fundraising marathon uh, that focuses on gaming of all kind to help kids at Children Miracle Network hospitals across North America and Australia. Um, I choose to support Seattle Children's with my fundraising efforts, so 100% of everything you see below me here goes directly to help sick kids at Seattle Children's. Sorry, my camera, I've been messing with it a lot lately because um, I'm trying to figure things out. Uh, get things, you know, camera closer, stuff like that. So got quite a few donations on Friday and I got a couple more today. So what I'm looking at is, like I said, five strands I need to put in my hair. Um, and so that's going to happen here in just a moment. Uh, I have, let's see, one, two, three, six strands. Sorry, there's six strands I have to incorporate and I do need to reach out to a couple people because um, one person did donate the amount required to get pick a color, but they didn't actually choose the incentive. And then someone else um, seriously blasted uh, my entire um, fundraising. So I need to reach back to them to see exactly what it is that they want um, because they will either get... 10 different colors or 10 of the same color or five um, different phrases or a combination of those two. Um, so that is to come sooner, very soon. Um, we're going to start with, I have purple. That is going to be the first color. So I'm going to just try to get my hair in front of me so I can kind of see what side I should put it on. Probably this side. I don't have very many colors on my left side. Um, just There's just not... I have... I see orange on this side. I think it's just orange. There's two oranges. So I need to add some different colors. So we're going to put a purple. We're probably going to put both purples. I have two purples and a blue. And I'm probably going to do them both on this side. So we're just going to find one. That one already has one. <laughs> we're going to do this one. We're going to put some purple on this one. Should be a good one. Um, so yeah, uh, just real quick so you all can kind of see what I'm dealing with over here. Um, I have this little section here. You can see that I have all the beads. All These are all the different letters. And then I have all the colors right here. Uh, so I'm going to be putting in... Um, grabbing some purples right now. Set those aside. I think I just lost one under my my tray here. Where'd it go? Did it roll super far? Where did it go? I don't know where it went. That's so bizarre. Did it roll off? Is it like how am I? I don't know where that went. Well, that one's gone now. I will grab another purple then. Maybe it'll probably show up later. Maybe did it fall? In? I don't know. I don't know where it went. So I'm not gonna worry about it right now. So we're gonna start off with some purple. Um, we're gonna get those put in, and actually I'm gonna go ahead and just I'm just gonna go ahead and get the purples and blues ready, uh, so that that won't take too long to actually get done. Um, so there's a first set of purple, second set of purple. It will randomly show up during a future stream. It will randomly show up during a future. Sh oh, yeah. <laughs> the, the another one. I was like, what are you talking? Sorry, I got literal literal for a second. And I was like, my brain just kind of just stopped. <laughs> but yes, it probably will show random. Oh, I just found it. It was further away than I thought. Um, now I have it. Now it's back in with its buddies. Okay. <laughs> so crisis averted. It has been found. Oh man, I'm realizing that right now that my voice, my not my voice, my voice is fine, but I'm realizing that my throat um, is a little like it's. I feel like I'm close to being hoarse, but not quite. 
Um, but you know, that's just because I had been talking not for three hours straight, but for quite a while earlier today. So there's that. Um, so yeah, we're going to find, I think I, I did find one. Yeah. Is this, this is, that's not the one I found earlier. That is definitely not the one I found earlier. Nope. Not that one either. I grabbed the same one twice. I think I just grabbed the same one three times. Let's do this one. We're going to put purple on this one. So I'm, <laughs> I'm going to hold this one here so I don't lose it. And we're going to, we're going to start by just making sure you got to thread the beads on. So it's fairly, fairly simple. It's not super intense. So the bead just kind of goes over the edge on this. So we're just going to put all of these on here. So those are all five. And I, of course I dropped it here. I was trying to keep it separate and I dropped it anyways. Let's try this one. This one might be a bit thick, but it should be fine. So what I need to do is then I just put my hair through the, the, the little needle there, and then I pull it through. It might not take all of them at once. So if I do one at a time, it's a little bit easier. It's probably better for my hair. So it doesn't rip out anything. So we'll get all five of those on. We'll de-thread it and then we're just gonna we're just gonna slide these up. It's pretty simple. Simple process. Can only go so far though because my hair gets pretty thick as it gets as it gets closer to the top. So we're just gonna slide them up kinda not eh, that's a good spot. Let's see, it's there. So kind of, I like to kind of space them out a little bit. And I usually use my hand as a guide um, just to, what's up Kirby Jules? <laughs> you were, he was admiring my hair at the event thingy. <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, welcome. Thank you for joining and much appreciate it. Um, yeah, I, I, I got some donations on Friday and a couple more today. So I need to, I need to do my part and add in the beads as requested. Um, so on my event or on my extra life page, you will see I have two incentives right now. Um, one is for $50 donation. Um, I will put a color of your choice and you have to select the incentive one. Um, and there's like six colors to choose from uh, purple, blue, yellow, orange, pink, and red something like that so you get to pick any of those colors um and i will put them in my hair on stream like i'm doing right now someone picked purple and so i'm just putting purple in um and then the other one is for a hundred dollars you get to pick up to 15 letters um and i will put that in my hair this one might work I got two strands. It kind of splits <laughs> this one. Okay, it's kind of funny, um, but because of my hair is just pretty wild, it's, uh, it starts off as one and then it splits here, right? So it splits, you can kind of see it. This one splits into two down here <laughs> and then this one splits to two up here. So it just shows you how wild and crazy my hair is, but I love it, it's, it's pretty awesome. So I'm gonna take this one and put the other purple on. Um, and then I gotta find a spot for the blues. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, but yeah, it's it's kind of a cool little way for me to just kind of like, hey, you know, you wanna, if you donate, I will show my appreciation um, by putting beads in my hair and these will stay in my hair until the end of the year. Uh, that is my promise to anyone that donates. So, um, any type of event that I go to, whether it's just to the store or out, doesn't matter. Like these, these are going to be in my hair the entire time. So um, I kind of did that because it's kind of like a cool thing to do, like I said. And, you know, if, you know, people, people ask questions like what, you know, what's, what's with the beads? Like, why do you have beads in your hair? Or, you know, sometimes people just look at me and just keep, keep on pushing, which is fine too. 
Um, so this one, this strand is a little loose. So I'm a little worried that these might not stay in. So I need to figure out, I should, I should, I need to find some, um, for right now, I'm just going to put a little knot at the end of this. It's not ideal. I don't like putting a knot in my hair, but I don't want these to fall out because this might come out a little, a little too much. Thank you. I appreciate it. Um, no, I think it's cool. Like, I like it. Like, it's, I don't think it's crazy. I'm just saying, like, I know not, it's not everyone's cup of tea. <laughs> so some people might think it's weird, but whatever. I don't care. Um, if I cared, I wouldn't do this. Uh, <laughs> so now I got the two purples in and I got to do blue. So this side has uh, someone, um, someone donated enough and they wanted to get hope put in. So see if I can get it to focus. There's hope. Um, so that's one of the one of them today. I'm you know I'm gonna find a spot over here to put the blue one just because I think I need more on this side. Will this work? No, that one will not work. It's it's too too much, too many splits. This one would work. It splits a little higher, but it should be fine. It should be okay. I'm gonna do blue all right on this one. So. Uh, I need to put the beads on here first. So yeah, it's um. Hopefully y'all were able to, if not attend, tune in to the uh, Seattle Extra Life and Seattle Children's Game On event at the Sandpoint Learning Center in Seattle in the uh, Queen Anne Auditorium. It was. Pretty awesome. Let me see if I can put in, let's see, I need to do a quick, if I go shout out to, there we go. So if you go there, Seattle Extra Life page, you'll be able to find the video from earlier today. Uh, we did a three hour gaming event where we gamed with um, patient, you know, current patients, former patients, um, employees of Seattle Children's. Uh, even <laughs> we were fortunate that the uh, CEO of Seattle Children's, Dr. Jeff Sparing, he joined us for a bit. We got to interview him on stage and uh, he actually played some uh, um, Mario Kart with us. That was pretty awesome. He uh, Mario Kart has a pretty steep curve. Uh, if you've never played before, and he said that he didn't, he he hadn't played before. If he did play, it was like very, very little. But you know, his first couple races, like it was like he was like in dead last. But by the time we actually finished, he was like finishing third, which is pretty awesome. I mean, that's a really good like comeback. So it was pretty cool to kind of watch him play, and he was having. You could tell he was enjoying himself and having fun with all the kids and stuff like that, and. Myself and Once O'Clock Wise Child. Uh, let me do a quick to. Did that work right? Yes. So myself and Once O'Clock Wise Child hosted the event uh, for Seattle Children. So we were up on stage just chatting with everybody and giving everybody crap uh, during the gaming. It was <laughs> it was a lot of fun. So we're glad we were able to do it. Uh, yeah, no more room. Glad you got to make it out. That was a pretty fun event. Oh, yes. Uh, do it longer next year? I don't know. I feel like I feel like three hours is I mean, granted three hours went by pretty fast today. Um it's a it's a it's a lot. <laughs> As someone who was on stage, I will say it's a lot. Uh, but it is a lot of fun. Um in the past we've uh I know we've kept it to three hours in the past because uh, some of the past ones we did, they were actually on game day. So I would start game day uh, with my friends. I would start streaming there, start my 24-hour stream. I would 
pause, go do the game on event at Seattle Children's and then go back. And so they wanted to make sure that we didn't that they didn't eat up too much of our time. So we kept it to three hours and that doesn't include like, you know, the travel to and from and then like the debrief a little bit afterwards and then travel, you know, afterwards. So um Yeah, someone attending three hours felt like it could be longer, but seeing all the people involved. Yeah, it was it was fun. It was fun. Like it probably we probably could do longer. Um, but I know that that's, you know, for employees of the Seattle Children's, like they have been working the entire week and the night before. And so that could be a long day for them. So I can understand them wanting to keep it short. But yes, Kirby, you are correct. It did go by fast, which is weird because you when it's you know i felt like because we got there early to get started it was it felt like okay man when is man noon is taking a long time getting here like wow it's like okay okay now it's noon okay let's go and then you're like holy crap it is three o'clock already uh so no it's it's a pretty fun event and i'm glad that i had the ability to do it again this year uh this is the one two three this is the third time that I've been hosting it well hosting it in a way yes because the first time the first this is the now I gotta think I believe this is the fifth I think this was the fifth one I want to say this was number five because so did this one this year. Last year was Once O'Clock, Wise Child and Myself. The year before that, it was just me. And then we did two events at the, we did two events at um, the main hospital. One was just in one room and then the next, so the first year was just in the Wright Auditorium. The second year was the Wright Auditorium. And then I think it was like the Anna Kleist boardroom, which was like right next to it. And then, yeah, 20, so that was 2017, 2018, 2019. Yeah, this was number five. This was pretty awesome. And I'm hoping we get to keep using the Sandpoint Learning Center because that was a pretty cool spot. Um, cannot complain about that. I mean, I could volunteer to help run it if it gives a break to some of the employees that have been working all week. Yeah, I don't know how they, I don't know. I mean, they have, there's a lot of, there was a lot of Seattle children's uh, employees today, uh, there today. So it was kind of cool that, um, yeah, it's quite the event. Um, but I know that they get excited for it too. Um, so we shall see. So I think, like I said, I think that was all of the colors. I did the two purples. I did the blue. Oh no, I missed another purple. There's three purples. One, two, three, three purples and one blue. So I need to do one more purple and I'm gonna put that on this side here uh, to kind of even it out. Is there anything in person happening for the November 5th? No, there is not. Um, <laughs> he can't spell November. No, so there's nothing in person this year. Um, yeah, so this is we're, this is the only game. This is the only event um, for the, you know, the only game on event was today. So um, I know like I like I have my team, uh, the one ups. We're going to be doing it like our own events where we just kind of gather at one of our friends house and we game there for the next you know 25 plus hours but uh no no other event also a green i don't know i think i missed something uh, i'm trying to find a good one that won't slip slip the beads on This is a, this should be a good one. Okay, now to plan my game day marathon. Yes, yeah, um, I'm gonna be packing up quite a bit of my stuff. It's always quite the event. Like I have, you can't see them, but I have a like a bunch of bins back over here where 
I put my laptop and the microphone and the camera and the arms and the lights and all the other cameras and I don't know if I'll be bringing any of this stuff because it might not work where I'm going. Um, but yes, but yeah, I'll be, uh, I have to tear majority of my stuff down, pack it up, um, and take it to my friend's house. And then, and I lost, I lost it. Where'd it go? I was not paying attention and I let it fall. There it is. And, uh, yeah, so I'll be taking all of the majority of my stuff to my buddy's house to do the game on event there because we, like I said, we like to do it all together, um, in person with each other. And it's pretty fun because we got to, you know, we get to cheer each other on while we get donations, you know, if we get donations and, you know, last time my friend, he was doing like push ups uh, every time he got like a certain amount. Oh my God. He was hurting so bad uh but he he stuck it out and did it so that i thought that was pretty awesome so i'm gonna raise these a little bit higher because i don't want them to slide off my daughter has a tendency to like sometimes she gets behind me and then she just kind of like starts sliding them off and i'm like leave it alone <laughs> uh yeah so um yeah i've been doing the 24 hours for the last nine years um some of them I've been getting a little breaks because I I will do the extra life event, but I still end up doing like I still end up staying up for 24 hours. Actually, by the time I'm by the time it is said and done, because I need to get to my buddy's house before we actually start to make sure that my I mean I'd already checked my stream the night before, so like Friday on the fourth. I will be taking all of my stuff to his house. I'm going to set it all up. I'm going to do a quick test stream to make sure things are running. And then I leave it there. I come back home. I get some good sleep. Uh, and then I go back to his place in the morning. But I will get there a little early because I want to make sure things are still working correctly because you never know what's going to happen. And then I stream for 24 hours. And then, well, I usually end up doing 25 hours because this always happens on daylight uh standard time so it's the we fall back and so because we technically start at like let's say we start at 9 a.m we're gonna go until 9 a.m the next day and by if we follow the clock because it goes back that means there's an extra hour in there so it ends up being 25 hours uh and then of course after we're all done streaming then I have to tear down, pack everything back up, and then come home. And usually by that time, I get in a second wind. And so I will set up my station back again and then usually stay up until that night and then go to bed. So then I get like a full night of sleep. But I always take Monday and Tuesday. Well, usually I take Monday off. But this year, I'm taking Monday and Tuesday off because last year, taking Monday off did not help. I needed an extra day. So I'm going to just take two personal days. So it's all fun. Yes, the time change. That is something that not everyone remembers. And we challenge ourselves to just do that extra hour because it is like, oh, it's eight o'clock. I can be done. I officially gave for 24 hours, but we're like, no, we stay until it's 24 hours. It ends up being 25 hours. Okay, so see, I got the other purple in. Now there's two phrases that people chose. One of them is from one of my coworkers. It's awesome because she all she has a um a okay. So I'm just gonna say her her phrase that she wants to put that she wants me to put in my hair is Mr. Pickle. Uh, she has like a lot of pickles. Like pickles are her like that's her mascot. <laughs> so she has them. Uh, as her uh, her picture at work is not of her, it's of a pickle, and it's called Mr. Pickle. Uh, so she requested that, so I'm going to find one. Uh, I'm going to put one on this side for her, uh, and I will put that in my hair. Um, so first, actually, I need to find I need to find the words Mr. Pickle uh, because I don't have that yet. Um, so I got all the beads in here. So I'm gonna just try to like, gotta set them aside. So there's the Mr. part. 
So Mr. There's a I, there's a K, there's a E. I think there's only one E. Yeah, there's only one E. Um, there's the C. Oh, I need that K. Where's that going? Um, I need a P and an L. There's an L and there's a P. So Mr. Pickle. K L E, not E L. K L E. Ta da, Mr. Pickle. I know it's hard to see, it's a bit far away. Um, but yeah. So, Mr. Pickle, that is going into my hair now. Wait, what is going on? That K is all jacked up. Why does that K look that way? Let me see if I can find a different one. Do they both look the same way? They both look the same. It's kind of weird. I don't know why. This this one looks... That looks weird. Maybe it's just me. Okay, it's fine. Mr. Pickle. So that is the first one. And I want to put that one on this side because I already have some words on this side. So I want to put some on this side. Will that one work? I think that'll work. It's kind of in the front. So let me get back to the main cam. <laughs> Don't be discriminated against weird looking case. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry, Kirby. <laughs> so now the choice is do I want it to say Mr. Pickle going up or Mr. Pickle going down? So right now the hope is going down. I think it'll be better going down than up. So uh, we're going to just slide these on. So this kind of, like I said, man, there goes a, there goes the L. I'm going to bring that back. So pretty much the same way. And I, I did see that I got a couple more donations. I need to, I need to go to a different screen to see what that was. Um, and I will get back to y'all in just a moment. But yeah. Mr. Pickle. <laughs> so yeah, like I said, this is a pretty simple tool. I like using it. I'm glad I was able to find it. I'm a little disappointed that these beads, the, um, the opening is a little smaller than I would like. Um, but I, you know, found them online. Just happened to get what I was looking for. It was relatively inexpensive. So we're just gonna take this a little slow, get all of these on, and then we'll slide them into position. And hopefully, should be good. Okay, easy enough. All of them are there. I got some space to slide them up. Oh man, that is tight. I'm gonna put this somewhat close together so people can actually see what it says. Well, they won't be it won't be super spaced. So we're gonna do Mr. Actually, I will push them together. There. <laughs> it's a little tight. <laughs> it's a little tight on my hair, I'm not gonna lie. Uh got a little bit further to go okay maybe doing two at a maybe pulling two at a time isn't very helpful I got to be careful too because some of these are like right in my eye and if I turn too fast I'll be like whack ah ah mr. pickle in the eye that's too close I want it set there we go <laughs> there, Mr. Pickle. Is it focus? Yeah, Mr. Pickle. 
I need to slide, I'm gonna slide the mister down a little bit more so it's a little bit closer. Yeah, <laughs> Mr. Pickle in the eye. <laughs> I know, I said that and I was like, hmm. Well, can't take that back. <laughs> so yeah, so I got Hope over here. I got Mr. Pickle over here. I'll have to keep this one like tucked so that it doesn't smack me in the face so much. <laughs> Maybe I should separate, spread these out some so that it's not so weighted in one spot. Bring these down a little bit. There. It's spaced out, but it's still there. Okay. And then the other one is love. So I'm going to find one on this side. <laughs> I don't know how to clip Lee. <laughs> Be glad. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> like, yes. Okay. So I need to find love. Uh, L O L O. I got the L O V and an E. Easy enough. So we'll get that on here. And then we'll be on to the. And I can spell. I can spell backwards. I can do that. After this, I need, actually before I, okay, I have that set aside. Let me go back on here. <laughs> you would, Doug. <laughs> That's why you said green. I was like, green, like what is green? Like, what do you mean green? Now that makes sense. Dun, dun, dun. Sorry, give me one second here and I will get that going. Okay. Cool. So let me do the love real quick and then we'll do the green and then on to my my good news that I want to share with everybody. Yeah, that should good. That should work. Dun dun dun. Okay, that camera's still good. Okay. I'm gonna slide slide this up. Mm hmm so yeah um, the event today was pretty dang cool uh, it's always fun <laughs> uh, Kennedy and M are hilarious <laughs> just got a promotion a bit easier to justify that nice yes yeah my uh, I'm gonna be getting a performance evaluation here in the next couple weeks so um, we'll see what that looks like come the end of the year so there we go love is now in the hair love is in the hair sorry it's very blurry and it's white and it's a white area so Okay, now got to find the greens. Thank you very much, Nomaru. Much appreciate it. Think you are the first person to choose green so far this year. And this will wrap up the beads for today. And then we can go on to other things. But yeah. I'm glad that y'all were able to make it uh, the ones, you know, for those of you able to tune in and or be there. It was a pretty cool event. I'm like the space was awesome. Uh, if you tuned in online, um, that was a pretty big space. Uh, it was quite impressive. You're falling asleep. It was nice meeting you too, Kirby. Um, enjoy yourself. Go get some rest. Uh, I will be up for probably another half hour to an hour and a half it just kind of depends 
Um, I'm not tired. I am not tired yet. Um, so we're still going to rock it. But uh, yeah, feel free to check out the stream later. Um, today is Saturday. Yes, today's Saturday. Uh, I will try to be on tomorrow at some point, but I don't know because it's going to be a busy day at the farm and then we're going to go to mother-in-law's and who knows when we'll be back so enjoy fish doritos and looks like someone's dancing <laughs> i don't i've not seen those before so those are cool okay so green nomaru do you want it on left side or right side since you're on the stream i'll let you pick Left side or right side? Uh, left. So my left. <laughs> We're going to go for my left. <laughs> Since that's easier for me to understand. I think oh, this will work. I think I pulled a good one. All right. Some of my, some of these strands, some of my uh, dreadlocks are a bit thick, so it does make sliding beads on. Ooh, this might not have been a good one. Nope, I have to change it because uh, it's not going anywhere. So we're going to abort that. And we're going to find a different one. Not so thick. You would think it'd be easier to find one, but it's it's not that easy. Is this the same one? I don't think so. I think this is a different one. Only one way to find out. Okay, cool. It is not this not the same one. Okay. I'm gonna put this back here. These out of the way. And we're just gonna slide, slide it up. Something. There we go. So a lot of you may ask, does that get heavy? And I will say, I don't notice it. Um, I think my hair is pretty long as it is. And uh, I only really notice the weight of my hair when it's wet. Because uh, it gets heavy really quick when it's wet. Uh, it tends to retain quite a bit of water. Uh, and will take the majority of the day just to dry out. So um, I won't notice these beads right now. But... Uh, I might later, but I don't know. Right now, that is that is it. That is all of the beads. All of the ones. It's uh let's see. Got those on this side. So I got I got plenty of strands in here. And then here's all the ones on this side. So yeah. Oh, like I said, I just can't, I can't be whipping my hair back and forth and, you know, cause I don't want to get Mr. Pickle in the eye. <laughs> oh my God. That's funny. Okay. Um, and it's nowhere near that long <laughs> yet. <laughs> Mine is actually, uh, it was funny cause I was talking with this, uh, with the, um, the guy at the desk today on the way out and he had dreads as well. His were about. His were in a ponytail, but I think his were probably about to his like upper back, maybe just about his shoulders. Mine are at my lower back. They're basically right above my butt right now, to be honest. And um, I have been very cautious about going to the restroom uh, because the last thing I want is to dunk my hair where it shouldn't be dunked. <laughs> so it's always like, Okay, let me uh, move my hair this way and let me put it over here. <laughs> Maybe put it up into something because this is 
it's pretty long. Like it's it's in so but it's it's been a journey. Uh this is like somewhere between 10 and 13 years worth of growth for me. So and I haven't cut it in that long. So it's um it's pretty good. Um what time is it? 45. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. Sorry, I'm just trying to go through my messages to make sure. Let's go. <laughs> and yeah, no one talks about potty problems with long hair. Never heard of it before. <laughs> it is a thing. What's going on, Shorty? Thank you for joining. Okay, so we are getting to the point where I wanted to share the news uh, today. Um, share with all of you. Sorry, my throat's feeling really dry. Let me make sure. Okay, so. Um, how, do I, how do I start this? Um, okay, so. As you know, I stream for Extra Life. Um, what you may or may not know is that I'm also part of the Seattle Extra Life Guild. Um, and these last two years, I've been part of the um, leadership team for Seattle Extra Life Guild. Which, And for me, my position is streamer relations. I do my best to make sure that when people join us, they are welcomed. Um, they get all of the... Uh, information that they need if they're curious about streaming and oh it's an ad break does it cover up the whole screen or is it or is it like just part of the screen because I can't tell maybe you can't hear me so I will wait it'll be better dun, 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 dun. I don't know how long that ad's going to be so Nice. Ads over. Okay. <laughs> well, thank you very much. <laughs> no more ads. <laughs> no more ads. Okay. Uh, let's see. Yeah. Let me see. Is I, It should be good for a while. So it shouldn't do an ad for a bit. And I should hopefully be done by the time the ad comes. Um, so, uh, like I was saying, I'm... Not only do I stream for Extra Life um, as part of the Seattle Extra Life Guild, I am also on the leadership team for the Seattle Extra Life Guild. And every year, um, we on the team, we on the uh, the leadership team, as also with uh, the our representative from Seattle Children's, we uh, we talk amongst ourselves and we choose someone who. Um, basically represents Seattle Children's um, as well as Seattle Extra Life and the Guild and basically just kind of, you know, we try to do something to thank them for their service, for like helping um, expand the community and just like being um, a good steward to the Seattle Extra Life Guild. Uh, and uh, this year, um, you know, they happened to do the whole announcement on uh, on the stage today during the uh, our event, and um, I am very excited to say that I won this year. Uh, I was awarded the uh, twenty twenty one Guild Member uh, Appreciation Award, and I'm going to show you guys the award uh, that I got today. Um, this was a complete surprise. They actually did it live in front of everybody. I did not expect it. Once o'clock wise child was like talking about it and just like kind of giving the background of it. And I was like, oh no, that's, yeah, it's awesome. Like, yeah, this is what we do. We like, we do it every year. And I believe she's won it before. And so like, we're just on stage riffing as what we've been doing like all day so far. And I got it. Uh, 
she like and this year tim we would like to present you and i was like what <laughs> and i basically just like laugh on stage because like i said i didn't expect it uh it's pretty cool so i have it here and i'm going to try to show you guys what it looks like um so this is it it's a pretty solid piece of glass so you can see it says let me see if i can angle out so seattle extra life 2021 guild member achievement award and you know i'm just you guys can see my name it is fine uh but this thing is pretty cool it's pretty sturdy it actually stands up um i don't know where i'm gonna put it yet it'll probably be somewhere over here eventually but you can't really see it so it might need to go up on the shelf maybe maybe like in the box something like that i don't know um but this is pretty cool like i was not expecting this today um so it was a very very much a pleasant surprise so you can see like we have our um our logo for the seattle extra life guild and then 2021 guild member achievement award um so that was pretty awesome i am I don't have a lot of words to say how much this means to me. Like, this is pretty cool. Um, was not, was not, like I said, I wasn't expecting it. Um, you know, it's not something that I like, I didn't, I'm not part of this for this. Um, I'm, I'm doing this because I believe in it. And, uh, you know, I, have been this is my ninth year doing it and like so far i think i'm over fifteen thousand dollars that i've raised so far let me see if i can find my total um remind me later uh da -da -da. let me see if i go to my dashboard and see if i can find how much i've raised to date um No, that doesn't show my donations to date. Where is that at? There is a way. I don't remember. Um, but yeah, super cool. And like, like I said, I do this because like this is something that like I believe in all of this. Like the fact that I can sit here, I can talk to y'all, I can play games get donations and it help kids in a hospital. Like you can't really go wrong, especially if you like gaming. Like this is something that I'm, I'm going to, I do game. Like this is like prior to joining extra life. Like I already was playing video games, but I never stream. Like I didn't start streaming until I started doing the extra life stuff. Um, and I think the first year, the first year or two, I did not stream at all. Uh, it wasn't until later where I started like, let me get a laptop, let me get a webcam and some lights and like, let me get a capture card and let me figure this out. So I've been slowly like adding to my stash of streaming gear and it's, I enjoy it. Like, this is pretty fun. And like I said, I'm already going to be gaming and if I'm going to game for like more than half hour to an hour, like there's days where I don't stream and I do game. Uh, because I feel like there's a different level of having to address people and talk to the camera and keep an eye on chat. Like that's a little bit, sometimes that's more than what I can handle for the day. Like some days I'm just like, oh, I just want to sit and game. And so I will do that. Um, but then there's days like this where it's like, no, I, I have some energy still and I can totally do this. And so um, it's pretty awesome. And um, I don't see myself stopping this anytime soon, even though... I'm getting old, <laughs> uh, but I, I enjoy this and I, you know, I have the ability to have the time to do this um, when like the kids are napping or uh, in the evenings when they're asleep for the night. Cause like, that's like right now, like I have some time. Um, so I kind of like try to make sure I get a chance to squeeze it in when I can. So uh, I just want to say to those of you in the Seattle Extra Life Guild, uh, thank you for your support in all of this. Uh, thank you to the Seattle Extra Life uh, membership, not membership, leadership team. Um, this 
means a lot to me and I really appreciate it. And, um, yeah, it's, this is, this is really cool. I'm looking forward to doing more, um, as I can right now I am in school, so it's a little harder for me to do more outside of the, the chats and kind of just helping out where I can, because that's as much as I can do. Uh, but when I am able to, like, I'm definitely going to up my, my game because this is, this is cool. Um, and I want to make sure that this is not taken for granted. Um, and I want to keep showing, uh, my efforts for this. So, uh, thank you all again. This is awesome. And yeah, let's see. It is 1140. How much energy do I have? Do I want to do? I've been streaming for about an hour. Mm. Let's see. Um, I think we can do some gaming. Question is, what do we play? Um, let me just look real quick. I think I want to do something a little bit different. So I'm going to switch cams so y'all can see what I see. I have quite a few games here. Uh, a lot of these I have not touched. There was one, oh, there was one that I looked at the other day. What was it? There was something I had downloaded that looked interesting. I do not own Dandy Ace. That one's probably going to have to go away soon. There's a couple of these that I downloaded via Game Pass that are gone now. Um, so let's see if I can find it. Hades, I don't have any more. Let me just double check. I'm pretty sure that that's gone now. Yeah. Wait. Okay, yeah cancel I do not own it um, games and apps yeah so yeah Hades is it was on the game pass now it is not so we're gonna uninstall that and I believe dandy ace is that same so this one's gonna go bye bye too. I'm just gonna get rid of it right now to keep it done. Um, dun dun. What? There was a game that I saw that I wanted to play. Ooh, this is definitely one of them. I might do that one. It might be a little bit of a longer game though. Decisions, decisions, decisions. And. Where'd it go? I don't remember the name of it. Oh, was it this one? It might have been that one. Um, Sea of Solitude, that one was fun. Shadows Awakening. Uh, some of these I don't even remember. I don't remember some of these games. Super Hot, Super Liminal, those were fun. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, I think it was this one, Windbound. I think that was the one that uh, I saw recently that looked pretty good. Um, but we're going to just, I'm going to go back to the top again. I just want to see what it is we are going to do for a little bit. I'm not going to, I'm not going to game for too long because I do have to get some sleep. Uh, we got some family time at the farm tomorrow. Um, so we're going to make sure we have time for that and I, and you guys can't even see what I see. So that is interesting. Let me see what is going on here. So we're gonna deactivate and then activate. Properties. Why is this not working? Sorry, give me a second here. I'm trying to troubleshoot in my head. If I go here, 
Okay, we know that works. Oh, it is just not working at all. Give me a sec. Sorry, going through some technical difficulties real quick. Cancel. Aha, there we go. Now we are in business. Okay, so now you guys can, now y'all can see what I see. Uh, I thought you were seeing it before, but you were not. So there's that. Okay, so trying to decide what I want to play. Like I said, there's a lot of games on here. Um, too many games on Game Pass. That's like um, Sleepless, what you were saying. Um, yeah, the Game Pass. So, you know, because they are, they do cycle games out. Uh, yeah, if you start playing one and you don't finish it before they are getting ready to get to basically drop it off, you can't purchase it usually at like a lower price, but um, I pretty much decided a long time ago that because um, uh, Game Pass, uh, and I have the Game Pass Ultimate, so it's it's expensive. Um, it's a yearly thing. It's like 180 something a year, or something like that. Um, but because I do that, I have told myself, unless I'm super, super, super excited about the game, I'm not going to buy any games because I have a ton of games that I can play and it doesn't cost me anything extra because I'm already paying for this membership. Like, I'm already going to have Xbox Live, so that's something I'm going to have anyways. But It's more to do the games, uh, but it's for me, it's worth it because I get to, I get to play a bunch of different games and I don't have to buy them all. Um, and I get to play the full game and, you know, for them... The way they treat it, if it doesn't do well, it's usually, you know, that's usually the ones that they drop off. But for me, it's it's plenty. If I don't get the finish one, oh, well, you know, I still had fun playing it. So it just kind of depends. Um, so let's see. I need to pick something to play with for a little bit. Um, I don't finish the games. Yeah, I, exactly. Like. There's a lot of these. So all of these ones that say um, gold are ones that I own. And then there are also some other ones that don't have any markings like these two. Like I also own these. I have not. I don't think I've even started Halo Wars 2. Um, and I know I haven't finished Halo Spartan Assault. So it's just like uh, I'll get to it eventually. <laughs> One of these days. Uh, but yeah, it's. It's it's a lot, so that's why I'm like I, I can't I can't buy any more games. I'm j I just I I I've chosen to not buy any more games um, because I don't need to. There's I have way too much to play as it is already. Um, hmm. What do I want? to play. Oh, Rain on Your Parade was so fun. I think that was a Game Pass game. Yeah, it was. So, we're gonna get rid of that. That was so much fun, though. It was cool. While I was playing that game, I actually talked to the guy, uh, to one of the developers of that game. That was kind of cool. He saw me streaming it and jumped on this stream and was chatting for a little bit. So, that was pretty cool. <laughs> it's such a fun game. <laughs> <laughs> but it was really cool. Yeah, I know. You said that. I remember you saying that you bought that. Didn't you have like a, it was like a whole kit? Like you bought like a specific edition, right? Like a special edition. Uh, game card. I think this is the one. 
Oh, super liminal. That's what it was. Okay, my bad. Yeah, so I'm going to play special or different of a short hike. <laughs> what is that? A short hike. <laughs> Okay, so we're going to jump into Raji. I think it's how it's pronounced. It's the cutest game ever. You play as a bird named Claire. You're waiting for a cell phone call, and your aunt says that you that you get a good signal on top of the mountain. <laughs> it's just a short hike. <laughs> that is hilarious. You're like, ah, oh, this. Is... <laughs> just like cursing your aunt on the way up. Damn you. <laughs> Ah, yes. Adorable and wholesome. You can't go wrong with those as a combination. So we're going to start this game. Not played it before. Should be interesting. It needs an update. Fine. I have gigabit. It shouldn't take too long. We're going to wait this out. You know, I haven't dropped any links today, so I'm going to do that real quick. So beware chat. It's going to get full just for a little bit and done. So need about another minute or so for this to complete. What else can we talk about while this is going? Um, I still have, uh, as I was saying earlier, there are two people that I need to contact um, regarding their, I think, is it two people or is it more? two people that I need to contact to because one person donated $50 and so I need to make sure that they get to choose their color and then someone else donated $500 and I need to get in touch with him to see what he wants to do with that because that's a lot what why did it go from a minute to 10 minutes oh because my my download rate just dropped went from a hundred and I'm supposed to be getting gigabit service you guys like you can't see it let me see if I can no you can't tell um, the number is just behind my picture but I'm supposed to get I'm supposed to be getting gigabit because that's what I pay for right now I'm only getting a hundred and sixty seven that's not good not good at all it should be like flying through just like go 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 but it's not so it is what it is but it, it works um let's see i can close that window now don't need to save that because i don't need it and i need to do a bunch of thank yous but i will do that later And we are at 61%. Um, so I'm going to not have y'all worry about looking at that. Um, what can we talk about for a few more minutes? Um, my internet just went up a lot because a tech came over to fix things. <laughs> yes. <laughs> have you tried turning off and then back on again? Sometimes it's that simple. No joke. Um, trying to think here. Yeah, the, that's just the that's the thing right now. The, what bugs me is because, yeah, I'm hardwired in. Like, it, you can't really see it because it's behind. Oh, it's like right there. So that hard wire, there, you can see it. It just kind of it's just kind of hanging out. So this goes to my system. But um, that goes through the wall over to that direction into the router directly. Um, but I wonder if I just need to like upgrade the wall plate or something like that. But it looks like it's finished. So we're going to switch back. 
Yeah. No, this isn't nice. This is this is this was what was already here. So it's not it's not good. Um, I just left it because I was like, I'm not gonna worry about it right now. I'll fix it later. What I what I need if I it, it'd be nice if I was able to get some power into this and then I can have like a USB charger behind me. But I got plenty of USB stuff over here, so I'm not gonna worry about it. So here we go. We're gonna go. We're gonna play this game. I need a little bit of audio. I just. I thought I download. I thought I owned it. Was that a Game Pass game too? I guess I don't own it. I thought I owned this one. Game not installed. Interesting. I guess I don't own it. I, this must have been a Game Pass one and I missed the fact that it went away. So cancel. Did all that for nothing. Oh, sorry, I'm pressing the same button over and over again by accident. And I shouldn't. And that's too bad. I thought I picked that one up when it was like one of the game with golds, but I was wrong. Okay. Well, what's next? How about... <laughs> Ooh, I don't know. <laughs> I was like, oh, maybe. No, maybe not. Uh, may, uh, maybe not. Uh, dun, 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 dun. All right, we'll do Windbound instead. Let me update my stream info real quick. Windbound. Now I know that one's relatively oh yeah that's a game with gold version all right i think i'm about, i'm gonna play for just about like half hour just to kind of give a little tasty taste so i'm i'm, I'm starting to feel the excitement of the day come down and gonna get tired here pretty quick New game. Well, there's, let's look at the options. Display is good. Sounds good. Gameplay. Bam, 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 bam. Outfit. New game. Okay. Choose game mode. Adventure. An adventure focused windbound experience. Full inventory is retained upon death. Boat is retained upon death. Chapter progress is retained upon death. Combat difficulty is reduced. Okay, that seems like that sounds normal. Survivalist. A more challenging windbound experience. Only items in held inventory slots are retained upon death. Boat is lost upon death. Return to chapter one upon death. Standard combat difficulty. Wow, so that's, so that's the normal game is survivalist. Endless mode. We're just gonna go adventure. No shame in it. <laughs> like, it doesn't matter. We're just gonna play. We're gonna see how this goes. Actually, I'm going to put on headphones so that way I can hear a little bit better. And that way, y'all don't have to hear it multiple times. Don't need the mic. Pull with all your might. Oh, 
Oh, jeez. Leave my boat alone. Boo. <laughs> it's like, huh? 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 What in the world is going on here? Do not go towards the light. Do not go towards the light. <laughs> Don't do it. Don't do it. No, I don't have a choice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and done. Ooh, got a little stabby stabby. <laughs> Sorry, I'm learning controls right now. Oh, there we go. Yeah. <laughs> this is it's quite interesting. Okay. We're heading towards the lights. Even though it's not where I wanted to go. <laughs> it's never good when you go towards the light, people. Come on. <laughs> if you're lucky, you might find sea, sea shards around the ancient ruins. Use them to buy blessings and give Kara something something. Animals with thick hides take very little damage weapons without sharp metal or bone tips. And that was all I could read before I went to this screen. Ugh, feeling a little washed up. <laughs> can you guys, can you all hear the game okay? Do I need to turn it up some? It's not a lot going on right now, but still want to make sure y'all can hear it. Okay. Dun 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 dun. I'm just gonna turn it up just a smidge. Okay. It's a great looking game so far. Wait, what was that? Thick grass. Nice. This thick fibrous grass is surprisingly hardy. Through weaving, we learn the value of a burden shared. Obviously, I'm going to need some thick grass. So we're just going to... We're just going to get this while we can. I thought I saw something shiny over here. Starfish? No. What about this rock? Oh, there's the rock. Rocks are plentiful and extremely versatile. Born of the ocean's fiery heart. Worn smooth by time's caress. <laughs> yes, it's like if only I could do like some type of, um, you know, powered spin. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, there's another rock. And thank you. <laughs> A 
Okay. So, do I swim over or do I jump the rocks? I swim. I just picked up a copy of Lawnmower Simulator. <laughs> we were just, we were talking about like that last week, weren't we? I feel like we were just like different simulators. <laughs> like there's power washer simulator or um <laughs> what is it just like here's here's let's do all your chores <laughs> that you have to do in real life but we're gonna do them pretend <laughs> you can pretend like you're getting stuff done <laughs> uh let's see press rb to bring up inventory for crafting rope made from grass Rope made from grass. Nice. A simple pouch with seven slots made from woven fronds. Nothing too fancy. You can only have one bag equipped at a time. So let's do another grass rope. And so now we have to find some palm frond, whatever that is. I'm hearing like ticking noises. It was that. No. Come back here, foul beast. Oh, I have a stand number. It's gone. <gasps> Razor bub. <gasps> Get it. Ah, oh, I missed. Come back here, foul beast. So fast. <laughs> I don't think I can catch it. I gotta like trap it. <laughs> Cheater, come back here. Ah, oh, shoot. Stand still. <laughs> I need I need a good dinner. <laughs> really? I I know I hit it. Ah, oh, there we go. Nice. The unrefined skin of an animal. With some work, it will become a useful material. Nice. Okay. Dismiss. I'm chasing forever that thing. I'm running all around. Can't see. Got it. What you got for me? Small raw meat. That was a big animal, and I got small raw meat. A small amount of raw meat can be eaten raw to starve off hunger, 
but its restorative effects are temporary. Be a good hunter and a better butcher. And then some bone. Macabre, but bones are lightweight material with good balance of strength and durability. We're all consigned to dust, but until then, we may still have some utility. Remember, you can only carry 100 pounds back to the wagon. This is not Oregon Trail. <laughs> and I don't, haven't even seen a wagon. <laughs> New recipe, bone-tipped spear. I have no idea what I'm doing. Give me a second here. Uh, no. Weapons. Bone spear, stick spear, leather. Grass sling. A simple sling or not the most fun. Oh, that could have helped versus me trying to. Um, So we're going to craft this. Oh. Hmm. So I don't have a hammer to do rocks. So there's that. Food. I need to do a fire first. What else can we? Not a lot else I can do. Okay, so. Oh. So that's only to make the, okay. So this is good. We get some more rocks. I've already lost some stamina because I'm hungry. Um, I could eat the meat, but I kind of want to see. Do I have a map or anything? Oh, I do. It's very, very, <laughs> it's not helpful. The map is not helpful. It's not a helpful map. I <laughs> got it. <laughs> well, I didn't kill it, but berry bushes. Ooh. Koji berries. Oh, nice. That wasn't a lot of stamina. Oh, there's more. Where did these bushes come from? I felt like they weren't here before. <laughs> or did I just run that far away? Ah, oh, missed. Fine. Oh, yeah, I did not pay attention. So thank you for pointing those out. Got him. Got some more skin. Okay, okay. There's not a lot on this island. That is for sure. Okay, that's that's where I started. And I swam across to this. Okay, I got my bearings now.
I want that rock back. I'm gonna pick up some more rocks just to be on the safe side. Okay. So we're gonna just go around the outside of this island real quick. Just to see what's going on. Lots of rocks. All right, one more rock and then I'm done. Since there's plenty of rocks, I don't have to pick them all up right now. I was trying to hopefully I can't dig. I was hoping to get whatever creature that was coming out of there, but I don't think they are going to come out in the night. So I think this is pretty much the whole island. So let's go see. Oh, I got it. My grass sling is degrading. What? <laughs> Boo. Um. What? Hmm. Boo. <laughs> I can't even pick him up. That is unfortunate. <laughs> All right. So since I can't pick up anything yet, which is unfortunate. Uh... We need some berries. And we're going to hit up this area over here. I think this is the only thing I haven't done yet, is figure out what this is. Story time. Don't touch it. Don't touch it. No, don't touch it. Oh, you touched it. Of the ancestors, an ornate, mysterious ore, through the through ancient though ancient sorry though ancient, it remains in perfect condition. Occasionally, it trembles within your hands, in your hands, as if something resides within. If faith was enough, there would be no need for ores. <laughs> That's funny. To bring up the inventory and use craft material to use, to select the boat parts page. Select a canoe or deck and craft it in the water with A. Additional parts can be attached to your boat once crafted. Repair parts your boat, dismantle your boat. Grass hole. I need thick grass, which I have, and I need some grass rope. I'm just going to make a bunch of grass rope. And 
and let's see food I don't have fire yet so I can't do food Now I need some thick grass. Did I get rid of all of the grass? Hopefully there's going to be some more thick grass around and I didn't just use it all. <laughs> that would suck if I chopped all the thick grass down and now there isn't any more. Oh, see? Okay, there's some. Good, good, good. Ooh, and there's a little beastie. Really? Is my inventory full? Like what, what's up? I don't get it. Can I only, do I have too many things? I don't, I don't understand. Why can't I carry anything else? Um, right button. I have some confusion right now and I don't understand what is going on. All right, let's see if this, I had too many things. Amazingly enough, I can only carry six items right now. Let's see, just to see if my theory is correct. Yep, too many items. Got him. Oh, I didn't see that. Oh, you little punk. Oh. Oh, I'm getting plowed. Oh. oh. Nice. Oh, that was close. Oh, I was worried about that for a second. <laughs> I didn't think I was going to make it. That was very, very close. How about some meat? I can use a little extra meat. <laughs> okay. So I think I have all enough. Do I have enough? For the boat. I think I need some more grass. Let's see. No meat, only berries. I mean, I could eat the raw meat. It's not the best, but it's something, right? Um, I need... Where's the boat? I need one more thing of grass. Oh, there it is right there. 
Oh, that was close. Sneak, 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 sneak. I'm not going to chase it. I don't want to get blindsided by the boar. <laughs> Am I not feeling good for eating raw meat? Is that what that was? It was like a little dizzy. <laughs> I'm gonna grab some more rocks since I'm a little low. Hopefully it doesn't make it. Yeah, it looked like it made, like they were like a little dizzy. Like, oh, oh. Don't know what that was about. Okay, new recipe for an anchor and a grass basket. There we go. Keep that in place. And there was a grass basket. Simple place to store five items. Okay, let's go get some grass. But I'm out of rocks, so we're going to get some more rocks while we add it too. Tin is good. Oh, my other things are still there. Ooh, nice. Ooh, got it. Soft and lightweight, these fronds are perfectly adapted for carving through the air. If you wish to master the bow, you must steal the sky's grace. Nice. Yes, berries. Yay, more berries. Not enough berries. Need more berries. Oh, there's some thick grass. Okay. Um, lots of foraging. Ooh, there's another beastie. Out. Get off my berries. <laughs> and thank you. And my berries. There we go. This game is kind of fun. I like it. No, nah, that's right. Um... I think I needed more grass. I'm not seeing any right now. All that grass is gone. I think that's the next island I want to get to. Way over there. Or maybe that one over there. 
No, no, wrong way. Oh, there's an island over there, too. Oh, which way to go? Oh, there's some more berries. Anything for a little extra life. Can't dig yet. Still need two more thick grass. Anything for extra life. Yes, <laughs> anything for extra life. <laughs> All right, what do we got? Um, I want to see, I just need, I want to find some grass so I can Oh, there's some over there. I want to build the grass so I can build the last piece. I think I need two of these though. And I only, I only, there's only one. Yeah, I need one more. Hmm. I gotta, I gotta wait some time and wait for the grass to grow back. Yay. I guess if I go to another island, I can find some grass. I don't necessarily need it right now. Oh, get back in. Okay. Forward. Reverse. There's fishes. No. Did I really just, I did. I grounded myself. That's fine. It can stay there. <laughs> I'm like, press A to jump. Yes. I don't think this is something I can jump up. Oh, maybe I can. No, oh, little heart attack. The conch of the world. Okay. Nautilus key one of three. This beautifully adorned shell resonates with the mysterious power. An arcane relic from a bygone era. Much can be learned of the door by examining the key. Hey, game saved. And that's a good stopping point. Because <laughs> I am tired. Okay. Um, yeah, and with that, we're going to call it a night. Uh, sleepless books. Shorty. Nomaru, Kirby, thank you all for joining me tonight. Thanks you for 
uh, allowing me to um, gush about my award and join me for all the beads that I got put in my hair today. Um, this was a good day. And there's more to come. Um, uh, yeah, I'm feeling really... Yeah, I'm going to sleep really hard tonight. I, I can feel it. And um, and then enjoy the day at the farm tomorrow. It should be fun. Going to get some kettle corn and some apples and something else. I don't know. We're going to get all the treats tomorrow. It's going to be fun. Um, lots of pictures. So, yeah. Um, hopefully, you all have a good night. Enjoy your Sunday morning. And... Um, I will see you all maybe Sunday night. We shall see. I don't know. Uh, I, I'm not going to promise that I'll be on tonight, but I will try. Um, just make sure you hit the follow button. Turn on your notifications. That way you know when I am live. And I will see you all later. Have a good night. Uh, enjoy yourselves. Talk to you all later. Peace.